Now we're gonna yeah. get back to this show. And since we're talking about TV, yeah, we're here now. Let's talk about y'all it. Y'all saw it. Y'all know I want to talk about it. Because we done talked about a lot of gay shit already this right. episode. <laughs> so let's just get into it with Raven. Uh, oh, Raven, what, look, Raven, Raven, Raven. What's her song again? Because I be messing That's up all so Raven. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You know, her but, but her no. bringing this up is so Raven. <laughs> but you know what's crazy? I asked you that because here I go. We were uh, We were recording a Patreon episode. By the way, if you haven't yet joined our Patreon, we have a lot more dope content there. Oh my there. gosh, but it's I don't, so good. We were talking about Brandy. This was on the episode with Ray. And she brought up Moesha. And while I started singing Moesha, like, Moesha. No, like Taina. Taina. <laughs> <laughs> and I literally had to stop her and be like, no, no, no. That's wrong, Taina. Wrong jingle. Wrong jingle. <laughs> wrong set, wrong. Right. I'm wrong. a 90s baby for sure. Right. I started singing Taina. <laughs> Taina was my shit. I yeah. love Taina. You feel me? What happened to her? Christina got married. She was, she's in LA. Yeah, you know her real name. That's yeah, yeah. Say, we used what? to go. She used to go to um. She used to go to one. She used to go to one church. I hate you. I am Bridget. I we were talking you about just on her. I mean, I wasn't at the wedding, but I know she got married. <laughs> Is what, she guys? still singing? I don't know. She was singing in church. That was how I met her. Oh, Raven was singing too at one point in time. Oh. Uh, but Raven Simone, guys, says that she declined Disney's offer to make her character a lesbian in Raven's Home, which is the reboot to That's So Raven. Um, <laughs> Disney reportedly gave her the option to make Raven Baxter a lesbian for the That's So Raven reboot, Raven's House. And she said that she declined. Raven Simone who came out as a lesbian in 2013 Girl. after the legalization of same-sex marriage revealed mm. during the recent appearance at, <laughs> oh, on the Pride podcast that Disney Channel executives asked whether she was interested in having her, Raven's home character, identify as lesbian in the reboot. This is what she said. You want right, to read what she so said? I, no. Look, no, you just we like don't need to, to read what she I, said. You, you, you I, don't? I grew up loving Raven. Okay. I grew up Me loving too. Raven, but I also feel like Raven is like the most in the closet, out the closet person <laughs> In this well, industry. isn't she the same person that said she's not black or she's Afro? It's a different oh, sort of. She said she wasn't from Africa. She's, she's just, just black. Illuminati. <laughs> no, she's Jesus. in the Illuminati. But no, the reason that this story bothered me is because I feel like for Disney to take a chance and and yep. offer that right. is a big deal. Now, had she come to them and said, "I want to be." a lesbian couple on the show and they said no there'd be this huge fucking ah, protest right. about how there's no equal rights and this is me and all this stuff so I felt like if they gave her the option even if she didn't want to do it why are you bringing it up right yeah like that's yeah. honestly how I feel like why bring it up like I feel like they did their part by trying to support you in my opinion I well, agree I, with but that. it's also I think I think we we keep asking for these opportunities of exactly. inclusion exactly and we keep fighting for there to be representation, right? And it's it's the the one thing I will say, I do agree with you that it's it's annoying that she turned it down, but I will say that I know I know quite a few people that don't want to be pegged as the representative and the and for mm. this moment, right? And we talked about this, we talked about this last a couple of weeks ago about the importance of inclusion, right? Yeah. And how it's hard to show up as yourself and just exist as yourself yeah. versus or and do your job versus having to be the token person. So she maybe 100%. didn't want to come in and be like, and I agree. And with I'm you. Raven, the lesbian black she, woman. I don't, I don't <laughs> Disney she, met their quota of inclusion <laughs> right. for the year. Like, I, I don't think she needed to do it. I just think that it, it, it was pointless for you to bring it up. I feel like they offered it. Take it. Cool. You didn't want to do it. Move on. I didn't feel like you need to bring it up because now it's almost like, the way it's put out there is almost like they did something wrong. And I feel like they did their part in trying to support the new culture. And you know what? To be fair, they they, they often talk about this gay agenda in television. Right. But it's always as it pertains to men. Right. To be fair, the exactly. only representation that women who, who like women have on television film normally is bisexuals. Yeah. Right. And honestly, right. you go from even um, in the Spike Lee joint... Um, what was it called? With Nola Darling. With Nola Darling. Uh, she had she's all of, gotta have it. She's gotta have yeah. it. She had all of these male partners and then also had a woman. And then right. you, you see, I believe, even the character in M Michaela Cole's film yeah. also was bisexual. Mm -hmm. So to be fair, I can't off the top of my head ring a lesbian representation that's on television. And I think that this would have been great because a lot of us grew up on Raven, so we probably would have checked it out. Right. May have resonated, resonated with us, maybe not. But to also have... 
that younger demo see black lesbianism right. as it should be portrayed or it, again, I just don't see it on television. So I would have thought that that she would have been one of the first. I'm a little I think. Bit, but you know what? As much as I would like to say I'm disappointed, I'm not. Because if I was, I, I would not necessarily want to know what Raven Simone's depiction of a lesbian character in this moment <laughs> is because of who Raven Simone is. I would mm, not. Okay. Her her conversations around her own personal relationship with her race and her identity oh. <laughs> is enough for me to not like. Maybe she's not the one. It's okay. Like. I'm cool with us us passing that opportunity to somebody else who is really interested in in representing right. and, and Bridget speaking said it's giving the, Stacey Dash. It's giving, <laughs> and, <laughs> and we could just miss it. It is because the thing is it's giving, this, I'm not this, black, I'm African American, maybe kind of sorta but not today. Like I don't <laughs> This girl, spinoff has been on air for years. Yeah. This isn't like a new spinoff. Right. Like so Again, bringing this up now is just so irrelevant. It's like, silly. Like, why are we talking about this? If you said oh, no, you said out? no. This show has been the the reboot has been going Look on for me. years. I and I just yeah. clearly and she's wasn't just now because well, we don't watch the Disney Channel like that. You yeah. right? Well, because now it's on an app too. Like, bitch, no nobody pay for cable no more. So you I gotta do. like get the Disney Plus. You app. pay for cable? I you, do. I do. Do you I really? Pay. So I tried to get rid of it because <laughs> I got rid of it because of the way I travel. But then it's like the moment I was home, I was like, Ugh. oh, yeah. Pandemic. So there's, a, there's, Pandemic an, app, made you there's an app about. that gives you like all the channels. So. I heard, but I don't know. I just like turning on the TV and just having the TV. It. Oh, there's yeah. a guide on the app. And so when I call, <laughs> really? <laughs> it's sli- it's a lot. The app, the app is a lot. We're not even going to say their name because they should cut yeah, a check. Yeah, they got to cut a check. We, we want to get paid more. I remember yeah. calling and being like, oh, can I have my cable back? And they were like, what channel do you want? I said, all of them. You want all of them? Do you have Netflix on this channel? You know what's crazy about all of them? Yes. That should be like 200 plus a month. It is. For the channel. And I feel like they bill every week because every time I pay, it's like I'm getting a new (laughs) pop up like your bill is due. And I'm like, God damn. I just just paid y'all. No, what happens is you you probably pay it late. Right. You probably pay it late. I do. I pay it late. I be paying my shit late. So they be coming back two weeks after they turn it right back on as soon as you pay it. They do. Listen, I told y'all I only got a few bills on auto pay, but everything else, I just wait till they say they about to cut it off. (laughs) And then that's when you pay. That's right. the, it's called balance. Right. Okay, now, you know. Here we hey, go. You don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow. Something you might not. That need is it, correct. So that is correct. Time. 